might, but pick the peppers. I can pick your brain and put your heart together. We the Nothing built can last forever. And every legend, no matter how great, fades with time. With each passing year, more and more details are lost until all that remains are myths, half-truths. To put it simply, lies. And yet, in all the known universe, between here and the Far Lands, the legend of the Order of the Stone endures unabridged as self-evident fact. Indeed, it is only a troubled land that has need for heroes, and ours was fortunate to have, so long ago, four heroes such as these. Gabriel, the warrior, before whose sword all combatants would tremble. Eligard, the redstone engineer, whose machines would spark an era of invention. Magnus the Rogue, who would channel his destructive creativity for the benefit of all. And Zoran the Architect, builder of worlds and leader of the Order of the Stone. These four friends together would give so much to gain their rightful place as four heroes. Their greatest quest would take them on a dangerous journey to fight a mysterious creature known as the Ender Dragon. In the end, the Order of the Stone emerged victorious and the dragon was defeated. Their story complete, they slipped away into the pages of legend. But when one story ends, another one begins. Would you rather fight a hundred chicken-sized zombies or ten zombie-sized chickens? Yeah. Just to be clear, you wouldn't have any weapons yeah. or armor. I'd have to go with the giant chickens, not because I want to or because I think it would be easy, but because they would be an abomination. Imagine their giant feet. Like I said, an abomination. So, I've got a daylight sensor on the roof. Mm -hmm. And if I did this right, these lamps should turn on once it gets dark. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to just leave Reuben here with nothing while we're at the building competition. He's coming with us. Really? <laughs> what kind of question is that? Of course he is. Okay, I'm not saying he shouldn't come. I'm not. But don't you think it's a little weird that you take him with you? You everywhere you go. He kind of makes us look like, I don't know, amateurs. It's not weird at all. Reuben is the best pet I could ask for. Obedient, loyal, and always happy to see me at the end of a long day. No friend. I should have said friend, not pet. I didn't mean anything by it. I'm glad he's coming. I just don't want to give people one more reason to call us losers. I'm getting tired of it. We are not losers, Olivia. We lose all the time. It's okay. what we do. Oh, okay, that might be true. I can't remember the last time we've won anything. But if that's the case, it means we win at being losers. <laughs> all right. Fine. Did you hear that? Oh, no. Boom! <laughs> Is totally freaked out. Now we're gone. Ugh. Axel, what's the matter with you? Great. Now I'm gonna smell like a pig in Endercon. Cool mask. It is, isn't it? Yeah, very convincing. <laughs> the look on your faces. Did you bring the fireworks? Of course I did. I even brought something for the little guy. Nice. You brought Reuben a disguise? Um, we're going to a convention. Somebody's got to wear a costume. He looks awesome. It only took me like a million hours to build it. All right, all right. You definitely brought the fireworks, right? Yes, I'm ready. Waiting on you guys. Hurry up and grab your stuff. We'll meet you downstairs, okay? Okay. Shh. 
shears. Definitely taking these. Never know when I might need to shear some sheep. One of these days, we're gonna win the Endercon building competition. And when we do, people will look at us and say, hey, there goes Jesse and Ruben, winners of the Endercon building competition. You really should change the name. I got this stand as a gift, but don't have any armor to put on it. Maybe someday. Gabriel the Warrior. I think we'll ever get that famous? It's not impossible. Maybe I'll get famous for my sweet poster collection. Hmm, flint and steel, not too shabby. Give me a dragon roar, Reuben. <laughs> That'll do, Reuben. That'll do. That's everything. Let's roll. Yeah, dude. Roll. Let's go. I heard a pretty juicy rumor about the building competition. But you guys have to promise not to say anything. Okay. Also, it's in two parts. Each part more exciting than the last. Spit it out, Axel. Part one, the special guest at this year's Entercon is none other than Gabriel the warrior him freaking self. Whoa, what's part two? Part two, according to my sources, the winner of the building competition is going to get to meet him. It doesn't mean anything if we lose. But if we win, oh man, this would make up for all the losing. Meeting Gabriel would be a dream and an honor. Totally. He's awesome. It'd be amazing to meet him. Reuben better be careful in that costume. The last time Gabriel saw a dragon, it didn't end well. So, does this source of yours make posters for a living? Huh? Yeah, my uh, source uh, doesn't exist. You guys are my only friends. Guys, let's stay focused. We have a competition to win. We never win. And this year we've got Reuben oh, with us. No. We basically have no chance. We're going to win because... What are you talking about? Because up to now, we've hated losing. But today, today, my friends, we're going to start learning how to love winning. That didn't sound as good as it did in my head. No, no, I'm with that. All right. Wait a minute, wait a minute. We're thinking about this all wrong. The point of the building competition isn't just to build something. We have to do something to get noticed by the judges. Okay, then. So how do we do this? We don't just build something functional. We build something fun. After we finish the fireworks machine like we planned, then we build something cool on top of it. We might be onto something. If we want to get a reaction out of the judges, you build something scary. So I say we build a creeper. Wouldn't an Enderman be better? I'm more scared of Endermen than creepers. They both have their moments. They're both pretty scary. Then again, you scared the crap out of us with a creeper today. <laughs> All right, let's build the creeper. You're going with Axel's idea? What's wrong with my idea? Nothing. It could be totally cool. It is cool. Yeah. I think this is the first time we've decided on something before getting to the competition. Think we've got everything we need? It wouldn't hurt to grab a little more. Let's get to grabbing then. We're so prepared. We can't lose. Cannot. Bring it in. <laughs> Dare to prepare on three. No, no, no. Preparing is daring. No, that's, that's the same thing. Forget it. A team on three. One, two, three. Team, team. prepare. Oh.
We know what we're building. We've got all the stuff for it. We are so ready. This year, it's going to be different. I'm not just ready to build. I'm ready to win. Nice pig, losers. Mm. Oh, great. There's Lucas and the Ocelots. The rivalry continues. Man, they've got matching leather jackets and everything. So cool. Well, well, well. If it isn't the order of the losers. <laughs> Great. <laughs> the fail squad's here. Lucas, get a load of these losers. Let's go, guys. Name, please? Axel. And uh, how do you do? No, your team name. Team name? We are not ready for this. So much for losing anonymously. We're the Nether Maniacs. You just thought of that right now? Yep. We've never even been to the Nether. Who the Nether cares? Okay, Nether Maniacs, you guys are in booth five. Hmm. Nope. I don't like the look of this. Beacon? Freaking beacon? That's stained glass. They aren't just building a beacon. They're building a rainbow beacon. We're gonna lose. What are you worried about? We've got this. Who are we kidding? We've got nothing. We've got a mascot. <laughs> we should probably stop staring at them. <laughs> Look. It's the Order of the Losers, again. <laughs> Good one, Gil. We're just looking. There'll be plenty of time for you all to look at it after it wins and gets shown at Endercon. You're being unpleasant. Maybe not all of you. Endercon doesn't allow outside food or drink. <laughs> I'm talking about your pig. Shut up. What's that? Jesse said, shut up. Do you need to hear it again? I don't know. Maybe. Stop wasting your time, Aiden. We've got work to do. You're lucky I'm busy. Hey, Jesse. Guys. Hey, Pet. How's the bill going? Only time will tell, but we're optimistic. Hey, Petra. I forgot to thank you for that Nether Star. Hey, Lucas. Not a problem. You help these tools? For the right price, I'll help anyone. If you need anything, you know where to find me. None of us know where to find you. Exactly. No hard feelings, guys. And if you're cool with Petra, you're cool with us. So why don't we just forget about all this and, you know, make this about how cool our builds are. May the best team win. Careful what you wish for. We'll see about that. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Endercon Building Competition. <laughs> The winners of this year's competition will have their build featured at Endercon. The winners will also meet, in person, Gabriel the Warrior! Ocelot! 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 Whoa, handshake? We don't have a handshake. We'll just <clears throat> make one up. We'll call it the... The Builder Bump. Hmm. And just like that, I'm nervous again. Don't talk like that. We can do this. Just stick to the plan and everything will be fine. This year, the Nether Maniacs can't lose. Let's do it. Building starts...
Oh no, a fireworks dispenser. I'm so scared. You worry about your build, and we'll worry about ours. Now, the moment of truth. Here goes nothing. Oh man, that looks so cool. We'll win this for sure. The creeper was definitely the right way to go. Guys, people are looking at us. Good build, man! What? No way. It's just a bunch of dyed wool. Whoops. Oh no, Ruben's on fire! Ruben, no, come back! It was Aiden. That the lava's getting closer. It's gonna ruin the build. Ruben's going to get lost. We've got to do something. But our build is about to go up in flames. You guys stay and save the build. On it. We've got to cover, Jesse. Be careful. We'll meet up with you at Endercon. <clears throat> Ruben, where are you? Just give me an oink if you can hear me. Must have run by here. It doesn't look like this fire will spread. I bet Ruben started this. Ruben, are you in there? Ruben! No, not you guys. Pigs! Hey, all pigs but Ruben, shut up! It's getting scary out here. Ruben. Ruben. Oh no, you in there, buddy? Oh jeez, please don't be toasted, Ruben.
there you are. Let's get out of here, Reuben. Hope you're ready for some more walking. We gotta hurry back to town if we don't want to run into... <laughs> Ruben, run! I think... I think we're good. I think we made it. Make a run for it, okay? I'll meet you back in town, I promise! Get out of here now! Get out of the open. I want to show you something. Not that this isn't a really cool, dimly lit tunnel, but how far away is this thing you want to show me? Careful, Jesse. You don't want to get a reputation as a wimp. This isn't my first time in a cave, Petra. Yeah, but have you ever seen a wither skull? Whoa! Fresh from the nether. You're the first person I've showed it to. You risk your life for that dusty old skull? Oh, I risk my life for the thing I'm gonna exchange for that dusty old skull. There's this guy I'm meeting up with at Endercon. He's gonna trade me a diamond for it. Being the resident go-getter pays off every once in a while. Is a wither skull worth that much? <laughs> Are you kidding? For all the trouble I had to go to get it, I should be asking for much more. Wow. Wow what? In a single day, you went to the nether, you killed a wither skeleton. I mean, I did build a super cool statue, but still, it's pretty sweet being you, huh? You know, you could come with me. I mean, if you're too nervous, I totally get it. But I wouldn't mind a little backup. You want me to come with you? Consider it my charitable act for the day. I'll consider it whatever you want me to consider it, as long as I get to come. You just keep a crafting table down here? Comes in handy. Since that wooden sword of yours got busted... You're giving me a new one? Even better, you can make your own. One stick plus two stones equals one sword. Just grab what you need. Oh, okay, thanks. Hey, is all this stuff yours? No, we're just stealing from whoever was dumb enough to leave this here. Of course it's mine. Just making sure. Oh, here we go. Jack... Just place the pieces on the table.
See? Isn't it better when you make it yourself? Check it out. Endercon's all lit up. I can't believe it. We won. Axel was right. Everyone loves a creeper. Good for you, Jesse. It's about time we beat Lucas and his gang of jerks. What kind of stupid name is the Ocelots, anyway? You know, Lucas may be kind of arrogant, but he has come through for me in tricky situations. You might want to get to know him. Just in case. He's good at building, that's for sure. It's always useful to have a guy like that around, no matter what you might think of him personally. Yeah, you might be right. I'm just saying, if you run into him at Endercon, try talking to him. I don't need a lecture on the power of collaboration, Petra. How about a lecture on the power of my fists? It's short, but deadly. Come on, let's hurry. Remember what Endercon was like before it was cool? Remember what we were like before we were cool? Some of us will never be cool. Ha ha. Creepers! Uh. Crap. Ah. This doesn't look good. Well, there's only one way off this bridge. Whatever we do, we do it together. All right, let's jump. Don't you know? You dive into the water. You don't land on top of it. Pull yourself together and follow me. Just let me know if you see Reuben anywhere. He's got to be here somewhere. I hope you're right. So, when we're making the deal, I need you to let me do the talking, okay? I just don't want anything to screw this up. Or anyone. Sure, I'll let you handle it. And if you want to be really useful, try to look intimidating. Like this? I'm less scared of you than scared for you. Jesse. And Petra? Hey, you all know Petra, my new super close friend. We're super close now. We ran into each other while I was looking for Reuben. Couldn't find him, huh? He'll turn up sooner or later. I just know it. I saw him, but before I knew what was happening, we were under attack by a zombie horde. I told him to run. It was for his own good. What were you doing in the woods, Petra? Nothing. Just drawn by the sound of Jesse's high-pitched screams. I would have been spider bait if she hadn't found me. Sorry we didn't come with you, Jesse. But hey, we won! Looks like abandoning friends and their time of need paid off yet again. If I didn't know any better, I'd think that creeper was really going to explode. We did okay, didn't we? I still wish I'd gotten that part in the back to look better. I could have fit more fireworks in there, somewhere. We deserve a victory party. Who's in? I like all kinds of parties, but especially ones where I get to celebrate winning. About time I'll be the guest of honor at something. Hey, Jesse, it's time to go see about that thing. Oh, right, the thing. Subtle. Yeah? As a punch to the face. Axel and I were going to head into Endercon anyway. See you in there? I heard somebody saying there's free cake by the map booth. Hurry. We're supposed to meet in the alley over there. Dark. Dark. Very dark in here. 
That's weird. He said the dark, creepy alley close to the gates, but he's not here. Maybe he's late. Are you sure this is the dark, creepy alley he meant? Hmm. I was. Okay, new plan. You stay here, just in case this is the spot he meant, and I'll look around. I guess I could have heard him wrong. Then again, I've never gotten a meetup spot wrong before. You can't seriously think you're just gonna leave me here? If you can manage to stay alive in the woods, I think you can do the same here. I'll be back before you know it. If he shows up while I'm gone, just stall for me. <clears throat> and just who are you? I'm waiting. The name's Jesse. What's it to you? I'm supposed to meet with Petra, not whatever you're supposed to be. Give me one good reason why I shouldn't walk out of here right now. Well, I'm a very busy man. You're the guy who needed a wither skull, right? Not so loud, you idiot. Too many people know my business already. Do you have the skull? Uh, well... You do or you don't. You'd better not be toying with me. Petra has it. She'll be back any minute now. Well, as long as she's bringing it. I suppose it wouldn't kill me to wait a minute longer. Uh, well... Ivor! Ah, here she is. Sorry I'm late, but good things are worth waiting for. I've got what you ask for. If you have what you promised us... You didn't say anything about an us when we first met? And I don't like surprises. If these are the sorts of people you associate with, perhaps we should call the whole thing off. My friend is fine, right, Jesse? There's no problem here. Let's not be too hasty, okay? This is just a little misunderstanding. Let's just do this thing. That's what I thought. Proceed, then. I'll take that diamond now. Take it. You've earned it. This isn't a diamond. No, it's lapis. Of all the dirty, underhanded tricks to pull. I can't believe that guy got one over on me. Let's go after him. I'm either getting that diamond, or I'm getting my skull back. No, it'll make him pay, right? Right? Come on. Do you see him anywhere? Lost him. Then we'll just have to find him again. Go. There he is! Gabriel! Gabriel! Step aside, I have just one question! Hold all your questions until after the keynote. The keynote sold out! Hold all your questions anyway. You guys big Gabriel fans or something? Too bad it's sold out. What's up? What's up? Nothing. What's up with you? Nothing. What's up with you? I, I just said nothing. Hey, uh, congrats on the win. I mean, I still think our beacon was amazing, but you guys did a pretty good job, too. I mean, I thought the whole monster theme was plenty cool, but fireworks, too? It was sort of cool. Yeah, well, my team earned it. Yeah, I'm kind of starting to rethink my choice in teammates. Hey, you didn't happen to see a creepy guy with long hair and a beard roaming around, did you? I don't think so. Why? He kind of scammed Petra out of a diamond earlier. Oh, everyone knows you don't mess with Petra. Not if you know what's good for you. I'll keep an eye out, okay? Thanks, I appreciate it. So, uh, we're cool? Yeah, we're cool. Cool, cool. Too cool for school. 
coolness. <laughs> see you later, Lucas. Yeah, see ya. Ha <laughs> <laughs> I see you now, weirdo. Well, if it isn't Team Trash Bag, how's your stupid pig? I hear intense heat causes brain damage. Aiden, you idiot! Hey, who are you calling an idiot? You, now move! Hey! Hey, what do you think you're... What do you think you're doing? Oh, I'm sorry. Get away from me! I said I was sorry. Ruben, is that you? Get your pork chops here, fresh off the bow. Nothing sticks to your ribs quite like a juicy pork chop. Ruben! What's the big idea? I'm trying to run a business here. That's my pig! Oh, really? Well, I found him out in the woods, so I think that makes him my pig. Not the fattest pig I've ever seen. But he should cook up real nice anyway. Please, he's my friend! To me, he's inventory. I might be amenable to some kind of trade. Not that you look like you've got much of value. <laughs> I gotta get some kind of return on my investment. Otherwise, it's straight to the slaughterhouse for this one. Give me back my pig. All right, you little maniac. Fine. Take him. It's yours. Come on, Reuben. I'm sorry, Reuben. I never should have let you run off in the woods. Remember that thing I had to go do with Petra? Long story short, we met up with this guy, he cheated me and Petra on a deal, and now we're trying to track him down. You in? Oh, I'm in, all right. Any sign of him? I thought I saw him earlier, but it was just a false alarm. Wait, there he is! Looks like he's heading towards the hall. We're gonna have to get past that usher to follow him. Let's go! So, yeah, hey. What would it take to get us inside tonight? Uh... Tickets? <laughs> that was a good one. You should laugh. Get out of our way. We need to get inside. Now I need you to show your tickets, or else I gotta stop you right here. Chicken! 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 It's gone. You're totally fine. You're totally cool, dude. We have to do something. Like what? This show has been sold out for ages. I could bust right through. I just need a little wind-up room. Any other bright ideas? We need a distraction. A lot of chickens running around might be a distraction. Shoot, shoot! Get out of here! Usher is afraid of chickens. What would you say if I told you I want to break this guy's chicken machine to create the mother of all distractions? But you have to break that pane of glass. How are you going to reach it? Let's look around. There has to be something we can do. I need to reach that window, but the fence is in the way. But I don't think I can mess up the fence if he's around. that glass with a slime block. Oh, hey, we meet again. <laughs> hey. One slime block, please. We don't give out slime blocks here, just slime balls. We've got a limited supply today, and we're only giving out two per customer. You could craft your own slime block if you had nine slime balls. Can I please 
please have some slime. Ugh, whatever. A round of slime balls for everyone, please. Wait, this is only eight slime balls. We need one more to make a block. Okay, we need to find another way to get some more slime, and quick. On it. Uh, just one more thing, ma'am. One more slime ball, please. I'm afraid not. If I break the rules for you, then I have to break them for everybody, and then I'll be out of slime completely. Sorry. Come on, please. Gotta find one more slime ball. Hey, uh, Lucas, can you do me a favor? Anything's possible. I need slime balls. I swear I have a really good explanation. Whatever you guys are doing, count me in. Thanks, Lucas. Told you he was useful. Aw, oh, man. This guy isn't actually cool, is he? Remains to be seen. It's crafting time. So, you guys been building together long? You've got good chemistry. Are you jealous? I'm just saying, I think it's cool you have a team that works so well together. You're totally jealous. How's it going, Jesse? You know how to do this. A slime in every slot and uh, every... Ta-da! One slime block. Gross. I'll take that. Right... there. It's all you, Jesse. Give me a boost. Where'd he go? There! Through that door. What do we do once we catch him? There are a million ways to play this. But considering this isn't my fight, I'll follow your lead. We politely ask for what's ours. Short, sweet, and to the point. Not bad. You ready? Ready. You see anything? He must have gone out another way. What is all this? Looks like it used to be the basement. Weird place to have a hideout. I bet you anything I'll find my wither skull here. And if we find anything else cool to steal along the way, so be it, right? Axel, that's not what we're here to do. I said we should ask politely, Axel. Yeah, but if the guy's not here, we can't ask. So I say, we take. I don't want to stoop to his level. But isn't that the best way to get back at him? Let's focus on finding the skull, not stealing. Nobody ever lets me have any fun. We let you hang out with us. The faster we find what we're looking for, the faster we can get the heck out of here. Mostly stuff about brewing. Oh, hello. <clears throat> too heavy. And too soft. But super flashy. Yeah, 
I don't think this guy does much fighting. Hey, you still have that one stone sword, right? Yeah, I had to wave it at this jerkwad butcher earlier, you know, to save Ruben's life. Impressive. You're keeping it? But I thought it was too soft, too heavy. Eh, it still might come in handy. And it is super flashy. Find anything? I want to steal that and that. I just want to touch that. Ooh, take a look at this. You're not gonna believe me, but I swear I had a dream about this. Okay, Potion, I know this is a big step, but... It's yours if you want it that bad. I've never wanted anything badder. There's no way he won't notice his fancy potion is missing. A good thief always covers his tracks. Fixed it. Oh, yeah, the perfect crime. What the hell is all this stuff? Soul sand. It was everywhere in the nether. What about that block in the middle? I've never seen one of these before. I wonder if I just take a closer look. Do you feel that? It's almost pulsing. How is it glowing like that? Maybe it's some kind of machine. If it is, it's not like any machine I've ever seen. Don't forget what we're here for. Find that skull. So, good news, weird news. I found the skull, but... What the hell? Why'd I risk my neck for that skull if he was in such a hurry to get it, too? There's gotta be something bigger going on here. This has gotta be connected somehow. The chest with the skulls was hidden back here with everything else. It's gotta mean something. But what? I think I know what's going on here. Soul sand plus three wither skulls. That's the recipe for a wither. But a wither? That's... One of the worst monsters there is. We came down here to find the skull. Well, we found it. Maybe we should just grab it and get out of here while we still can. Uh, guys, scatter! Me. Oh, wait. Surprised to see me? No, that's not good. Thought you were rid of me, didn't you? That's better. What was that? Who's there? Over here, jerk! What are you doing here? What did you see? Leave him alone! Yeah, back off, pal. You two! Did you follow me here? You thought you could just screw us over and get away with it, didn't you? We're here to prove you wrong. What are you going to do about it? I have what I want, and you have exactly what you earned. Pay us what you owe us. You give us a diamond, we'll get out of your hair. I won't be threatened. Not by the likes of you. Hey, nobody talks to my friends like that. Now shut your mouth, or else. Enough! You've wasted too much of my time already. Where'd he go? If you won't leave of your own volition, I'll happily remove you myself. Show our friends the door, will you?
And now, for the first time ever here at Endercon, we are very proud to present the one, the only, Gabriel! Please, please. Thank you. Are you with me? Everybody okay? Um, guys? Where's Lucas? I thought he was right behind me. Well, if he's not here, the only place he could be is... He's still down there. Ivor's got an iron golem and all the ingredients to build a wither down there. If he were to unleash it in this crowd of people, we have to act fast. It just so happens that the greatest warrior of all time is in the building. I felt a lot of we should ask Gabriel here. for help. This is the smartest way to help Lucas. He's tough. I just hope he's tough enough to hold out a little bit longer. We need Gabriel to get Lucas back and to deal with everything else we saw down there. We're doing the right thing, Jesse. I just hope Lucas can hold out against that golem long enough for us to get help. Come on, then. Let's crash this party. With the right training and guidance, anyone, and I mean anyone, can become a hero. You just have to believe it. I want you to look me in the eyes. And I want you to know that I'm looking into you. We just gotta push through this crowd to get to Gabriel. when uh, Elgard and the dragon, um, like, what was her favorite food? Bread. Next question. Oh, uh, Good manners. Come on, come on. Yes, next. What question do you have for the mighty Gabriel? Well? I saw something scary in the basement. I'm not following. This creep's been building a monster down there. I'm telling you, he's trouble. Is that so? Well, as you all know, trouble is what I do best. I'm not making it up. We really need your help. Hmm. Perhaps we should have this checked out. I have a question for you. Excuse me, sir. You'll have to wait your turn. Just tell me first. Do you really believe anyone can be great? With enough hard work? Yes. Was that where I went wrong? I simply didn't work hard enough? Ivor? Is that really you? How dare you interrupt like this? That's the guy who attacked us in the basement. I wish I could say I was surprised. If it's surprises you want, you're in for a treat. Why don't you tell them the real story, Gabriel? I see time has made you bitter. And it's made you an even bigger fool. Now these people were promised greatness, and I'm ready to deliver. I'm sorry, this is how they had to learn the truth. What's he doing? Nothing built can last forever, Gabriel. Ivor, no! Creature, attack! Stay calm. This foul beast is no match for me. Creature, attack! Yeah. What have you done? Gabriel! No, stay away! It's after me, not you. Look at him! The mighty Gabriel! Looks like true greatness is out of his reach. He may not be able to defeat this creature, but I can! Creature! Retreat! <clears throat> creature! Retreat! Retreat, I said! Retreat! He's 
lost control of it! Oh, no need to be alarmed, my friends. I have an elixir that will destroy this creature. That potion, is that? Uh-oh. Uh, what? Impossible. It should have worked. I took such care. The potion. Axel, you've got to throw the real potion. But finders keepers. You thieves, you're ruining everything. Axel, come on. Jesse, throw it. It's protecting itself. Without the command block exposed, the potion is useless. It wasn't supposed to happen like this. Marvel! Howard, come back here! Jesse, help me! Thank you. Ivor was right about one thing. I can't defeat that thing. Not on my own. Everyone's running away. Except for you. Will you help me? I must get to the temple, but what needs to happen next, I can't do alone. Of course! Follow me! down there. Abandon me. No, we were trying to warn Gabriel and get him to help. Jesse! Wait! Wait, we have to stay together! Jesse, help me! I can't hold on! Have everyone? We must set out for my fortress. We'll be better protected there. Thanks for that just now. Yeah, well, now we're even. 